Um, Tom, just so you're aware, um, we're recording this, and I'll probably put this in the public domain, so just don't keep your answer to the, uh, the screenshot. You wouldn't want to get a viral video now, would you? Um, yeah. So, um, the way we're going to do this, I've never actually done it like this before, so it's a bit experimental, but in any case, what you've just done now, I want to group it together with your behaviours to a certain set of values and just see how it plays out. It may work, it may not, who knows, let's see how it goes. It's still valuable because what will happen is you've probably got some tickets which are the same and that's fine. But we're trying to go and group them into these five different areas, six different areas. I'll start with you, Tom. What have you got? Tell me what you've got. Uh, share information. Ah, so, so what does this mean to you? Elaborate, please. Uh, procedural stuff. Uh, so there's templates, like recently launched ones, but it'd be specific like yeah. So so there is an explanation document, there's a spreadsheet supposed to be probably number one, and just look at this area, and that will give you some. So what, what I'm hearing here is to share info is to understand what everyone else is doing and share with everyone else what you're doing. Yeah. yeah. Uh, if that was a value, would you say, like, be open? Yeah. Openness. Okay, let's put those in here. Now, does anyone else have a similar ticket? Yeah. Yeah. What have you got, Sam? Share info and knowledge, yeah. Openness is a value, yeah. To, to me, to explain that, it's similar like the, the exercise we've just done. It's like you hold information that you might not know is actually important to me, yeah. but is actually handy for my client group and, and things as well. So, yeah. Okay, brilliant. Oh, yeah. Do you have that? You have that. So it sounds like we've got a value here of openness that you all think is important, yeah? Uh, understand each other's perspectives, brilliant. this here for the minute because this may actually align to another value but it is aligned to this as well okay Luma give me one of yours so I have open to change and new way of doing things ah open to change and new way of, can I grab that ticket yeah. open to change you said open but I don't think this is openness um, courage. courage do you reckon the courage to change because change is difficult Neurolo neurologically, we want to have the status quo. So to change confronts us. Yeah. Do you agree? So I'm just putting it upside down, but that's fine. <laughs> oh, uh, who's the yellow ticket here? That's me. Right. Um, Agile 101. This is and this is for YouTube as well. I know. I peeled top. You peeled like that, didn't you? Yeah. And it's, yeah. You know, we all know. If you didn't know, if you peel to the side, then the radius sits sideways, and you get a greater surface area, and it's more likely to stick. But here's a pro tip. Pull it like that, sits on flat. Um, because as a as Kaizen coach, the worst thing in my life is putting tickets up and they're falling down. Mm -hmm. And that will fall down eventually, that will stay on. Anyway, hello YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> okay, courage. Do you all, any of you else have a, a behavior that would align to the value of courage? So, yes. Go on, what have you got, Chris? Be direct and honest and be open. Ah, be direct and honest. Open, courageous, yes. What have you got? <coughs> I've got we call out Elmo and uh, the yeah. announce. Yeah. Raise concerns within the team. Raise concern within the team. So be open, but be courageous. And that's the biggest thing that we can do as an entire culture. And, and I think you'll all agree, you know what I'm like with radical candor. The commitment, the, the courage to challenge people. So I'm going to put courage here. This looks like it might be working. Give me one that you've got, which is not one of those two values. Um, positive attitude, choose your attitude. Choose your attitude. Why is that important? Um, I, I think it comes with some of the mindset stuff that's coming around, courage and other things. So it's, it's just in terms of how you are with the team and how the team engage with each other. It is, I suppose, you could either say you're being respectful to the team or yeah. you're being committed to the yeah. team. Would you think it's respect or commitment? It's your choice. I would think it's probably more commitment. Commitment, yeah, because as luck would have it, there's another C here. It's important to commit to one another as a team. We will rise and fall as a team. We'll either die as individuals or win as a team. So commitment is really powerful. 
Does anyone else have a ticket that aligns to commitment where people are going to, we stick to the agreed outcomes. So we, you may disagree in the discussion, but when you have a, a decision, you commit to it. Same thing, but I wasn't sure if that was a synonym of courage. But they, they do overlap, but value what we agree on. Um, Intel say disagree and commit, and that's exactly right. Intel is similar, but everyone has their nuances. Exactly, it's, and it's not about consensus, it's about consent. Great, I love this. Support team with the stakeholders role model with clients. Support team with stakeholders role model with clients. Okay, do you think that's a commitment value? Mm -hmm. Potentially. Or support team? Support. I think it's Sorry. about support, supporting the things that we're doing out there, so that's why I aligned it to ah. that. So. Well, you could, but I've got another value here I need oh. to fill. Oh. Sorry. Oh. Sorry. Oh. Sorry. I forgot. We do things as a team. That's commitment. That's commitment. Yeah, totally. Yeah. Um, but to pick up on this, because uh, I'm trying to hack the system here. Right. Mate. Um, focus. What do you think? Because you've got focus on one thing at a time. Focus on the value, the purpose of your team. Support the team and the stakeholders. Is that focus? Do you think? No. Your, your body language is telling me no. You let's put in commitment. I'll, yeah. I'll concede. Sorry. Yeah. Please, somebody tell me you've got a focus related. I, I have focus. Oh, thank you. <laughs> focus. But um, I kind of put focus on the focus on the issue, focus on solving the issue rather than the person and how the personality is and how he can come across. Mm -hmm. So sometimes I feel I would tend to disagree with an individual because I'm not really focusing on the actual It is a focus thing, right? Because you've got to focus on why am I here, what's the outcome I'm trying to achieve. Yeah. I mean, you did this straight away in that deal, Medina. You, you said put that purpose up here, what, what's the problem we're trying to solve? Most teams go off on a tangent and forget why they're solving the problem. Mm. Would you be happy to put that in focus? Yes. Does anyone else have any focus related kind of ticket? Can I ask something? The, the behavior I've got is really actively listen to the other's ideas and suggestions, but, 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 the, but, but the idea behind it was to. Well, just because I'm trying to make this system work. Yeah. Um, that's more respect, isn't it? Because yeah. you, if you don't respect somebody, you won't listen to their opinion. And we need to consciously do that. So for me, it's got those two purposes. One is, yes, yeah, respect, but two is, is to actually achieve what we need to achieve as well. Yeah, yeah I agree. And, and it needs to, there is an overlap, yeah, yeah, of course. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I think I've got like three for respect. Brilliant, thank you. I don't want to ask you that for earlier. So what have you got? Don't interrupt those who are speaking. You just interrupted me. Trust each other to get things done. Now, this one is a super, you like that? Teacher's pet, right? I'm gonna put that there, because trust. <laughs> <laughs> trust. It was there and then it wasn't. <laughs> trust underpins all of these. Trust is so important. Respect, of course, respect each other's opinions. We all have different opinions because we all see the world differently. And it's only when you understand other people's perspective can you therefore align. You know this stuff, right? I'm, I'm, I'm pretending I'm talking to developers. You know this stuff. <laughs> what else have you got? Uh, similar to what Chris has got there. I think we laugh and have fun. Mm. Fun. Oh, yeah. fun is important. Yeah. Laughter is important. Uh, I don't know where it would go. Yeah. Um, respect. respect. Did you know humans learned how to laugh before they could speak? That's how we used to socially bond before we could speak. Different part of it. Great. Uh, we have fun. Fun is important. Yes. Respect. I don't have any focusy ones yet. Yeah. Give me a focus <laughs> one. There you go. Phew. Right. We do. I mean, this is important. It's for me. Focus is the single thing. Have you got one, Simon? No. I don't. Well, the Just write it down. Can be focused. Which one is the Elmo? Yes. Yeah, that's we, although you need courage, Elmo and good enough for now is focus on yeah. the impact outcome. Right. Right. Don't be a perfectionist. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Are you okay with that? Yeah. I don't want to make it so cute, but I don't know what's focus on the focus on that or something else. Don't let each other talk. We don't trust each other. So that's a respect thing, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, this one goes there too. Airtime for everyone? Airtime for everyone, yes. Yeah. And no judgment. Mm -hmm. 
No judgment, respect. Uh, commitment. Can I say that's commitment? I'm sort of screen picking it up, but it is, isn't it? Because you're committed to one another. You know today, by the way, the exercise you missed, sadly, it would have been, it's an interesting question. Had Sal and Luma been here, would you have achieved it? Having two more people, would it have made life easier? Possibly. 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 Or well, having more might people have, here. Might have, might have made it more difficult. Focus. And it's a shame you weren't, because it was a great game. You'll watch the video. It's a great game. I'm not going to rub it in, don't worry. What, any more? Any more? Yeah. We turn up on time. And what's this? Commitment, focus, or respect? Yeah. Focus. <laughs> <laughs> it is. Yeah. We inspect each other's mistakes. Respect. Respect's so important. It's the trust only ever comes when you show and receive respect. We support each other, what do you think? Commitment. Commitment, yeah. We appreciate each other's strengths. Commitment. Respect. Uh, yeah, let's, let's respect. Well, some respect ones here. We respect each other's opinions, respect. Any more, any final bits, Matt? Priorities. Prioritize team. Ah. Where does this sit? Prioritise team and support each other. Prioritise, oh, prioritise the team, yes. Yeah. But prioritising would word. be a focus thing, yeah, yeah. Give support to the team when they need it. Commitment, of course. Have a laugh every so often. Respect, Respect. Respect. yes. Time. If you can't laugh, what can you do? Be a developer. Any, any more? Any more? Any more? Uh, yeah. Oh, Luma, you've got loads there. I have eye contact. Eye contact, which is, you know what eye contact is, for me at least, is focus. Yeah. And because as a coach, I have to actively listen and show that by, it's showing respect, it's showing active and commitment, but I believe it's focus, in my view at least. Understand, where would you put that? I think I'm going to call good enough for now, uh, and I'm going to give you a quick brief. So, Scrum, the framework of Scrum has five values. Focus, openness, respect, courage, and commitment. And they are all underpinned by trust. And they support the three pillars of Scrum, being transparency, inspection, and adaptation. So that's in the Scrum Guide, and this is a really important part of Scrum. And if you ever sit in a Scrum Master's course, it all focuses on these values. So the people doing PSM2 now, the questions are all, all is, are we committing the team? Are we focused? Are we being open? Are we being courageous? And so on. So those values I would like you as a team to have, I think it would be great to have as, as a set of values. And those behaviours that I think you will agree with align to those values. So that, I've never done that way before, but it seems to work. So let's upload it to YouTube and tell everyone that's what I always do. Thank you. Cheers. <laughs>